Hi, I'm Kenny Joya. Welcome to another one of my tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to adjust narration or voiceover timing in Reaper. I have a project here with some narration or voiceover, some music, which is going to go under the voiceover. And if we go up here, we can see there's a marker set at zero. And over here, another marker at 30 seconds. That's how long I want this piece to be. And notice the voiceover is too long. So I want to stretch it to fix this issue. Let's hear it now. I've known business people who are not realistic thinkers. Here's the good news. They were very positive and had a high degree of hope for their business. Here's the bad news. Hope is not a strategy. Realistic thinking leads to excellence in leadership and management because it requires people to face reality. They begin to define their target and develop a game plan to hit it. When people engage in realistic thinking, they also begin to simplify practices and procedures, which results in better efficiency. Like I said, the narration is too long. And we could stretch it by changing the project's tempo down here. Let's change it to 150. But notice it stretched everything. The narration or voiceover, the music, and even the markers we created. And we don't want that. So let's put it back to 120. Now let's go to the file menu and choose project settings. And we'll go to the project settings tab, then go down here to time base for items, envelopes, and markers, and change this to time. So now if we adjust our tempo, nothing will change. Not the ruler, the narration or voiceover or the music. So we need to find a way to just stretch the voiceover. So let's put the tempo back to 120. Now let's right click the voiceover track. Let's go to track time base. And instead of choosing the project time base, let's choose beats, position, length, and rate, which will now time stretch just this track. So now if we change the tempo, it only affects the voiceover track, not the ruler and not the music, just this track and its items. But there's still one problem. Let's zoom in. Notice the voiceover is now too early. Because we sped it up, it's coming in before zero. So we should use the tempo envelope instead. Let's put this back to 120. And let's go to the view menu and choose tempo envelope. And we can see the tempo envelope right here, which we could use to change the timing of the voiceover. So let's put our cursor right here, then hit tab, which will put us at the beginning of this line, then hit shift C to create a tempo change, which opens up this dialog, and we can just close it to create one. Then we can grab this envelope point and move it up or down to adjust the voiceover's timing. It needs to end before the 30 second point, which will go with our music. So let's readjust it. That looks pretty good right there. So let's hear it. I've known business people who are not realistic thinkers. Here's the good news. They were very positive and had a high degree of hope for their business. Here's the bad news. Hope is not a strategy. Realistic thinking leads to excellence in leadership and management because it requires people to face reality. They begin to define their target and develop a game plan to hit it. When people engage in realistic thinking, they also begin to simplify practices and procedures, which results in better efficiency. It ends perfectly over here. But if you notice, the stretching doesn't sound very good. That's because the algorithm we chose, which is the default, isn't the best choice for speech. So let's choose a better one. Let's go to the file menu and go to project settings. Let's change the default pitch mode to elastic 
soloist. And the pitch shifter parameter to speech. Then the stretch marker mode to tonal optimized. And with this algorithm, it should make the stretching sound a lot better. Let's hear it. I've known business people who are not realistic thinkers. Here's the good news. They were very positive and had a high degree of hope for their business. Here's the bad news. Hope is not a strategy. Realistic thinking leads to excellence in leadership and management because it requires people to face reality. They begin to define their target and develop a game plan to hit it. When people engage in realistic thinking, they also begin to simplify practices and procedures, which results in better efficiency. I think it sounds much better. And in most situations, we be done. This sounds pretty good. But we could also adjust the speed or rate of each line one at a time, just by adjusting the tempo envelope in multiple places. So let's put our cursor here, hit tab, add a tempo change, which puts a point right here, which will affect the speed or rate of this line. We can make it slower or faster. Let's hear it here. Here's the good news. Here's the good news. And we can do the same thing on each line one by one. We can adjust it here. Let's zoom out and adjust the whole thing from here. And we can readjust as many as we want. Let's do this line. Here's the bad news. Let's slow it down a bunch. Here's the bad news. And readjust this one to fit. So it still stays within 30 seconds, within this marker. And keep in mind, not every project has to be within time constraints, but you can still change the rate or speed of each line using this method based on your personal preference. So that's pretty much it. That's adjusting narration or voiceover timing in Reaper. I hope you learned something, hope you could use it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks.